So the 68.95.99.7 rule um, applies to a normal distribution. So what I've done here is I've just drawn a normal curve. I labeled the mean of 70. And since the standard deviation is 10 minutes, I just labeled three standard deviations above and three below. What this rule tells you is that about 68% of the data is within one standard deviation of the mean. So in this specific example, 68% of the data is between 60 and 80 minutes. Um, it's not a great picture, sorry about that. 95% of the data is within two standard deviations and 99.7% of the data is within three standard deviations. This question specifically asked, what percentage of students will complete the exam in under 50 minutes? I find it's easiest to shade the area you want. So this is what we're trying to find, the probability or the percentage of students, sorry, that will complete the exam in under 50 minutes. So let's use this, um, middle number, the 95. 95% of the students will finish between 50 and 90 minutes. Okay, so if I do 100% minus 95, that leaves 5% in these two tails combined. Okay, so 5% will finish either above 90 minutes or below 50. But this question only asked about what percentage of students will complete it in under 50. So I only want half. So I'm going to do 5 divided by 2 and get 2.5%. There are other ways to do this problem as well. Um, I know some students prefer to think about this, just the left side, being 50%. And then they find this by doing um, 95 divided by 2 which is 47.5. So they do 50 minus 95 over two, and you still get 2.5. So there's multiple ways to think through this. I like to think of the entire thing, subtract off the 95 to get the two tails, and then divide it by two to just get this tail.